sports to me now is everything and I'm just employed here just because of sports. So sports is life to me and I don't take it for granted. see them playing and this uh, football has changed the, the lives of many people. The people were segregated, the orphans, the MVC, most vulnerable children are now just, they see themselves at the same level. Uh, right now uh, the club has like 90 uh, members. Uh, my plan is, uh, and the plan for everybody is to see a very big team in our area, uh, both for men and women, because um, in the whole region of Iring, I think we have one girls team, and it could be very nice if we have uh, maybe two to three teams that could be competent. The system we have in sports, they don't take sports, uh, they don't give you the first priority, so it has been a problem. And the people who train just end up here. They have no platform to go further, to join the, 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 the big tournaments, the big leagues, you know. So it's a problem. But the other problem also is uh, our environment. We use on one playing field. That playing field be belongs to IOP, you see. And that was meant for the kids at IOP the orphans that are kept there, but we share now the playing field. And this playing field has been now occupied. It's used by the club members. It is used by the girls from the center. And it is also used by the students from the Lord's Hill High School. Right now we have only football, we have volleyball, and we have uh, netball. But we wish one day we could have basketball, we could have badminton. All this can happen if we get support from friends all over the world. And uh, we, do, we are not limited to ask for more sponsors, for more friends who would come to join. We welcome everybody, coaches, volunteers who are interested in sports to come and support, to come and help. This could be the part of their learning too. They could learn something from us and we could learn something from them. <laughs>